With us now to unveil this week's new issue of Time Magazine, Time's managing editor, Richard Stengel. Rick, what are we looking at this week? Well, we're looking at a subject that is bothering millions and millions of Americans, 70 million Americans to be exact. It is the problem of 401ks and why we need to retire the 401k and why it's not working for millions of Americans. The 401k, as not many people realize, was originally created by Congress as a tax dodge for executives 30 years ago. It was never meant to be the primary vehicle of retirement for Americans. And over the last 20 years, it has become so. And what we've seen over the last five years is, you know, if you had $100,000 in your 401k five years ago and you had the standard alignment of investments, you'd have less than that now. And what's been a disaster for people with the going into the Great Recession and now coming out of it is that the, the way the 401k works is that the closer you are to retirement, the less choice you have and the more money you're likely to lose. So people who are retiring were going into their retirement with hardly anything in their 401k. So, and we hear time and time again uh, people having to work past retirement age, past 65 or some even working into their 70s because their life savings were blown over the past couple of years on 401k. Right. And in fact, there's a quirk in the 401k, which is the closer you are to retirement, the more likely you are to lose money if the stock market goes down because you're putting less money into it. So right. that, that's what happened to a lot of people. So we talked to dozens and dozens of people who, you know, who have retired but now have to work. And, you know, the, originally the 401k was meant to be a supplement to the kind of retirement that you would have, pension plus social security. But as so many companies have gotten rid of their pensions, people have depended on the 401k and they've lost out. So what's the plan? I mean, I've been still. talking to yeah, your guys back do. here while I was waiting to go on, and I, they asked me what the cover was, and they said, "Yeah, tell me about it." You know, I've lost all. I don't even look at my 401k anymore. Yeah. So, so what what do you, what do we do instead? Well, what we do, what we propose instead, and that stories by a young uh, business writer of ours named Steve Gandell, is is a. Pen insurance pension plan, where instead of paying that money into a 401k, 6% of your salary every week or month, mm -hmm. you pay it into an insurance plan that guarantees you a pension, basically, for the rest of your life at about a quarter of your salary. And that seems fair. I mean, the, the problem with the people who have lost all their money in their 401ks is, 401k, isn't it supposed to be what you have when you retire? Why would you put money, 6% of your salary, into something that is a risk? And well, it's, it's a risk, and a then risk. it's also something where, where you deplete it. I mean, it's basically a bunch of cash that you have when you retire, and you're supposed to take out 4 or 5% a year. I mean, and everyone depends on how you... And the smart thing to do. It was well, look, for a long There's time. a whole business... I'm not sure it was. I mean, it's only... It's not even 30 years old, right? So right. you have a whole class of people who have grown up, these investment advisors who take this thing and are telling you to do something that nobody has right. tested or not. It's like a vaccine that they haven't really tested and they don't know what the, what the long-term influence but is. But in fairness, there w was an assumption that because you allowed wealthier executives to do it, that, that would mean that it would be a good thing for But remember, class. it was meant and, to... I'm not saying it was right. right. I'm just saying, but it, it, at the time, because we had right. that plan in Congress, as Joe remembers, and it was, a, it was widely encouraged that you take advantage of this, and we encouraged our right. constituents for that reason. It's but it was out. for executives who were trying to shield some of their income from regular tax in real time so that they could put it away where it wasn't going to be taxed. It was, you know, workers weren't even eligible for it when it first started 30 years ago. Let's, 